you've had a long career with so many great films and this movie when you look at it why do you still think that it has had the longevity that it does today? I mean, you know, it wasn't a, a sequel culture. It is, you know, a movie. There's others that have come in the in the Alien franchise, but this is the one that I think most people um, absolutely still adore to this day and look at as, you know, the seminal one in the, in the entire franchise. Yeah, you know, I think that's kind of like asking, like, um, Mike Ditka, why the 1988... Uh, Magic. Uh, <laughs> Uh, uh, Chicago Bears won the Super the stars Bowl. Stars just I mean, you just yeah. It, it, it was first of all, it was a, a wonderful script. Jim had already gotten his feet wet and done a fabulous job on a very low budget, you know, with the Terminator. Mm -hmm. So people were on their toes and knew that he was good. He. When I went over and saw the sets, as soon as I saw the sets, it was like, oh my God, it was unbelievable. And you realize that you were in something, you know, really, really good. The cast got along so well. And Sigourney, ne I've never heard anybody in this cast ever say anything negative about another member. And Sigourney, as a leader, really is, you know, she's beautiful, she's sexy, she's a great actress, she's, but she works, she's, she's like Jim and Gail, they, they're workhorses, you know, and so when you were not working and you heard uh, Sigourney was on the set ready for the shot, man, <laughs> you moved in a hurry to get it done, and so they were able to get so much shot, and there's a great behind the scenes on YouTube and making of, and it's just, the, everybody from from stands people to the set dressing to sound to music to everybody just you know just wanted to do the best they could and it just came sometimes things come together and sometimes they don't I mean bonfire of the vanities didn't come together <laughs> right you know? right exactly this one came together <laughs>